Dr. Margaret Inslee in the Department of Economics, and Sarah will speak to us today about optimal resource extraction with hazardous waste production and an environmental bond. Mining activities produce large quantities of waste every day, which is often disposed of into the environment and can cause serious environmental problems. In this respect, the Government of Canada requires waste reclamation or cleanup upon the termination of mining activities. However, some firms may go bankrupt by such cleanup costs and externalize their liability costs to the society. Examples of bankruptcies have been vast in Canada. The Giant Mine and Faro Mine are two famous examples of thousands. The bankruptcy of the Giant Mine has ex externalized nearly a billion dollars to Canadian taxpayers, representing the social welfare loss. What is the reason behind this phenomenon? My answer is inadequate environmental policies, and this is where my research comes in. I have developed an environmental policy called the environmental bond whereby each firm is legally obligated to deposit money with the government equivalent to future cleanup costs of its current mining waste. This amount is usually estimated by firms and has to be updated annually to reflect changes in damages and costs. The government refunds the firm's deposited money upon a successful remediation. Otherwise, the entire fund will be forfeited and will be used for future reclamation projects. Now, let's consider the Mount Poly disaster. The environmental bonding policy has been implemented, but there is a still a shortfall in funds. How come is this possible? I have investigated this and found that this outcome is possible if the bonds fail to reflect the actual cost of cleanup or if firms underestimate their liability costs. In this circumstance, the government can intervene more than before by monitoring the firm's behavior and considering penalties for non-compliances and underestimations. At this point, I want to conclude that the bonding policy that is combined with monitoring and penalties guarantees sufficient funds for future reclamation, mitigates the impacts of a bankruptcy on society, and aligns firms' resource extraction and waste preventive activities with the society's best interests. Thank you. <laughs>